After sitting since 1983 in a warehouse, this bright blue turbine has found its home. We took it out of storage in uh, early 2011, refurbished the unit. I mean, it's exciting to stand here now and know that turbine is down in this penstock right now, and it's going to be working for the city very soon. It was installed along the fish ladder in Sites Park. While it is in place, there's still a good deal of work that must be done. There's a lot of little uh, bugs we need to work out. We'll start up and commission the system over the next two to three weeks, provided we don't run into any more unknowns. We've had plenty of those so far. While some of the bugs have slowed the project, some have actually been a good thing. Originally, the paperwork on the turbine called it a 45 kilowatt unit. When we took the turbine in to have it refurbished, we discovered it was a 62.9 kilowatt unit, which is significantly more power. That power is going to be put to good use here in Howard Park, powering the rec center, the human rights building, the ice rink, and even lights along the East Race. We're going to produce about 100,000 kilowatt hours a year, more than we're going to need. We're doing what's called a net metering agreement with Indiana Michigan Power. And the net metering agreement allows us to put energy directly in the grid or use it in our facility either way. At times when we're producing more energy than we need, that energy will go, the extra energy will go into the grid and will be credited for that energy. That agreement will allow the city to use every drop of energy and stack up some serious savings. And that's worth about $40,000 a year to the city. In downtown South Bend, Frank Waugh at News Center 16.